Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Another Sunday, another haul. This time around we're shooting on Zara again with H&M obviously. I have an amazing try on haul video for you guys. Everything currently in stores. This is more of like end of summer type of haul video. And after this one, I might have like one more with summer pieces. And then from that, I am beyond thrilled to jump into all fall videos. And yeah, without further ado, let's get right to the video. So first things first, you guessed it, it's this beautiful, stunning dress. Instead of saving the best for last, I opened with a bang because this is literally my favorite piece of the whole entire video. I, if I would have seen this online, honestly, I wouldn't have gotten it, but I saw it in store and it was to die for. The fabric, the way it fit, honestly, I didn't expect much of it, but like, look how flowy and beautiful. I love the back. It's just so, so easy. And this is a very versatile piece that you can wear more towards fall because obviously you can belt it and do like a little bodysuit under or you can wear a long sleeve shirt with a turtleneck. Again, belt it with boots and that'd be such a cute look. I love this piece. Also, super print is super in style, so like jackpot. And yeah, so flowy, beautiful, easy, breezy, effortless. So I also found this a beautiful crop top. We all know green is the color. It's just a basic, super easy, super breezy. I love the color. It's just such a good basic that obviously I will be wearing in winter as well because I can always wear this and layer it with like a leather jacket on top, a blazer and a lot of other things. Also, you can wear this over a button down shirt and that is so stylish. I also found this Stunning linen button-down shirt because we all know it's not a can you style the haul without button-down shirt And honestly, isn't this like adorable and beyond perfect for summer? I mean, it's the most perfect linen button-down shirt super easy not much to say about it The color is perfect. The one thing I appreciate about this top the most is the fact that it's not itchy because we all know Linen clothing can be a little itchy sometimes if not made correctly and if it's not good quality but this one isn't, and you know the drill, a button down shirt. You can wear it open like this over something, you can tie it, we all know the drill, obviously. So cute, and then you can also just wear it button down over bikinis. I love, love wearing button down shirts over my bikinis. It's so cute, because again, it's still summer. So yeah, this is another favorite. This might be the only item that you may not find online because it was one of those pieces that you find at the sale section in H&M, but there were a lot of them and I've seen it in more than one store. I feel so weird doing this, but now I understand all those bloggers that whenever they wear something see-through on a vlog haul, they stand like this. I have to because otherwise like the world will see my nippies. But anyway, so, Honestly, I've never seen this top in this color. You know, we've all seen the gold version, the glitzy version, the crystal one, the silver, whatever, but the green one is to die for. I mean, uh, can we have a little commotion for this top? I'm literally dying. I was going to a friend's birthday party and I thought that my, this might work for the theme that we had. It didn't, but I am so happy I got it because I'm definitely going to be wearing this. It's so cute. So if you guys have any tips on how to wear these tops without showing your whole entire top top, please comment down below. Okay, okay. This is not for everyone, but this is going to be a love or hate type of piece. But listen, I have a vision. I have a vision, you guys. I want to have a vision. I have a vision. So follow through and let me know if you can see my vision. All right. Do you guys remember that black linen skirt I showed on my last Zara haul, the one previous to this one. So I pictured this top with that skirt, this red earrings that I have, a red lip, my hair up, or maybe like very wild and crazy, in Spain, maybe Italy, eating gelato, and just walking down the cobblestone streets. Do you see my vision? Thank you so much. It's gonna be everything. This is so good. I mean, literally the moment I saw it, I said, that has to be mine. I was walking down Fifth Avenue and I literally walked into the store just to grab it. I was so, so thankful it was still there because it was on the mannequin and I died and it's so good and I'm so happy I got it and I effing love it. So I hope you guys do too. And if you hate it, then that's fine because I love it and I have a vision. All right, so next up, and the only item that I think is not here to stay because I will be taking it back is this 
denim pants that I honestly don't hate, but I don't love. I don't know, like, H&M denim is either a hit or a miss for me, and I don't like hate them, like I said, I don't love them. I just wanted to go for something that is more white leg on the bottom, because obviously that's so in style. And I mean, I do like the fit of them, but I just feel that they make me look a little bit thicker on my thigh area. And you know, we all know I have like thicker thighs. So I'm very selective with the kind of denim that I wear because I don't want anything to enhance that area. I try to enhance my waist, which is the thinnest part of my body. So just for those reasons alone, I may not keep it, but I'll probably give them a try and wear them around the house for like an hour or so, see how I feel. And if not, then just return because as of now, they are a return for me. Okay, so now we're gonna talk about a bag. I don't know about you guys, but I am obsessed with straw bags, especially for the summer. This baby, I saw since the beginning of summer and I tried it on, I loved it in store, but for some reason I didn't pull the trigger. And then when I decided I wanted it, it was sold out everywhere, even online, but then they brought it back as per usual. And then I even saw it again in stores. So like it comes and goes, I guess, because it was gone for like a while and then it came back. And I am so happy I got it. This is perfect for my beach days. This is perfect for travel because it doesn't occupy a lot of space at all. So the best way to pack this, you can just leave it like flat on your suitcase, or obviously you can put things in there on top and on the bottom. And also I like love this to take with me to Central Park or where, when I'm around the city. It's just so easy, so lightweight, the perfect size, super stylish. Like, I don't know, I just like, I love, love, love this bag. And I think I'll have this for a very, very long time to come. It was only what, like I think $25. You just can't beat that. And now we're gonna talk shoes. I mean, who am I? I've never purchased shoes at H&M before. This is literally my first time and I probably went a little cray. It wasn't planned. I did not buy them all at the same time, I promise. But I mean, honestly, I've just had luck with these shoes this summer. I didn't know they had like okay shoes. So let's start with these. So in all honesty, I think these are an online exclusive because honestly, I only saw them once this store and I'm pretty sure it was like a return from someone. They were not even my size and they were in black, but I just could not believe my eyes because they feel like real leather and they are. And then when I looked them up and I figured, oh my God, they're real leather and they're so beautiful. I said, no, I need, I need to get these. Like they're so good. They're a good substitute for the Zara ones that everyone has and that I've had and I've repurchased a million times. They are actually better quality. They're softer because they are leather and they look very luxe. I also like that they have the square toe that's very in style right now and that they are a little bit thicker here. So gorgeous. Okay, now let's move on to my most worn shoe this summer. Literally my most worn shoe. And I don't even believe it. So it's these babies right here. Listen, I am not a chunky shoe type of girl. I promise you. But I saw these in store and I was honestly looking at the shoe next to these. I can't remember, it was like a pair of slides or something. But again, I've never purchased shoes at H&M, so I was like a little skeptical. And then I, I don't know why I tried these on, but I did. And I tried them on and I was like, wait, first of all, these are extremely comfortable. Number two, I was like, they're not that bad. And by not that bad, I mean, I was in that store for at least an hour <laughs> debating sizes because they don't come in half sizes. And then, I don't know, I just like fell in love with them. I figured out that these are basically like a H&M version and chunkier, of course, of the Yeezys. And I've never been a fan of those in all honesty. So I feel like this is my version of the Yeezys, but they're so comfy to me. They're so stylish. This type of shoe is so in style right now. And I just, I can't get enough of them. They're so good. So like I said, I love them so much and I wore them so much that I had to order them in black. In all honesty, I've never seen this color in store, so this one I did order online. The other one I did a size 7 in, so I basically sized down on a 7.5 or 8 for reference. And these I ordered in 7 as well because the other ones were a 7. And when they came in, they were literally like small. Like I could have gotten away with it, but one of my biggest pet peeves in life is small shoes. Like I can understand when someone has their toes out or when the shoe is too exact. I mean, whatever. But I ended up ordering the eight. I was just trying these on first, but they are definitely super comfortable. I know Steve Madden has a very popular style amongst bloggers right now and other brands, but to me, these are the winners. Guys, before I forget, I was about to wrap up this video. These earrings are from H&M as well. Honestly, I cannot find them on the app. I'm gonna go on the site and see if I can, because I did get these like maybe a month and a half ago. 
and I got them in store so they probably are still in store because I feel like their jewelry is always like the same throughout they are getting a little bit tarnished and I'm so sad I wish I got like a million of them because they're so good but these are like amazing they're like big and thick and gold like what's not to like and that wraps up my H&M summer try on haul I hope you guys enjoyed it I had so much fun I really missed doing these videos everything I mentioned like I said is in stores and current I'm gonna link everything down below if you have any suggestions comments questions make sure to DM me and at me on Instagram at can you style it and subscribe if you haven't done so already thank you so much for watching and I see you next time